What up, what up? It's your boy, you don't know Buddha, so you want to see me again. Man, I thought I would do this as soon as I got home from work. I went online a little bit, came home a little tipsy, you know, went to sleep. It's like two in the morning right now. <laughs> but, you know, your boy, someone asked your boy, Sim, are you going to get the next car? Call of Duty Coast. My answer to that is, check this out. This is how long I've been playing this game, right? Part four. Did not get um, that other card. Two. Mm. One. Three. Alright, so your boy been playing card a while now. But I must say I'm a little more biased to Infinity Ward Call of Duty. <laughs> you know, I've never been much of a Treyarch fan. Man. The first card I play, of course, my Warfare 4. I play the hell out of it. Then um Treyarch released that crap. I probably play it like maybe once or twice and I never really liked it so I never got it. Right, straight up. Then I played Modern Warfare 2. I played that for the year. Then I played it for even longer because I played Black Ops 1. I didn't really like it in the earlys. Then in the late half, probably like four months before Modern Warfare 3 dropped, I bought Black Ops 1. Started playing. And it was okay. But then I played Black Ops 3 all the way through again. Then Black Ops 2. I'm playing it. And right now I'm barely playing the game. <laughs> if I'm on two nights a week playing this game, it's a lot. You know what I'm saying? So the ghost, I gotta say, uh, you know, of course how your boy Sim is gonna get it. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? And it's just me, man. I prefer Call of Duty games, so I'm gonna get it either way. Because as your boy Jav mentioned in one of his previous commentary, he's not a game man. I realize I'm not a game man. When I'm looking at my library, I'm, all I'm seeing is first person. I'm seeing some Halos here, Battlefield here. I barely play this game. I got premium on it. Wow. FIFA, my brother plays most of the time. This ain't even mine. I think I've lent out Halo, the last Halo for this crap. And that's my library right there. You know, so most of the time, all I do is play Call of Duty. Because to me, Call of Duty is the only game that you could, like, only got like 10 minutes to spare. You can get on, kill a few people, and get back off. <laughs> Plus, like um, the online interaction, I doubt there's anything that could compare to Call of Duty. You know what I'm saying? So, um, that's your boy point of view on if he's gonna get the game. You know, if the game's gonna be good, I'm not like everyone gonna sit here and try to um, break down the game or whatever. And we haven't played anything yet. Come on, son. So usually I wait till the game drop, start playing it, then give my little two cents. That's just how it works. <laughs> right. So, you know, in all, you know, you're going to find Call of Duty around here, no matter what, because that's the most I play. I play some 2K13 as well, but I got that on PC this time. Next time I'm surely going to get it on consoles. It is what it is, man. Or PC again. I got a powerful ass PC. I might as well use it. You know. But you know Call of Duty is gonna be here basically. No matter what, I'm not gonna sit by and talk about how much I hate the game. Because I mean the game got its little tweaks gotta be made, but to me, it's the best shooter out there. Flat out. And there's nothing that can compare. I play Battlefield 3 a lot. You know, the game's good, it's different, you know, got to switch it up in a while, but 
you can't compare the card. I'm sorry. That's just my point of view, alright? <laughs> I mean, some of y'all might not agree, but it is what it is. I'm giving my point of view. You know. And um, other games like one player games, you gotta put a lot of time in those games. Someone like me, I'm usually doing something. I'm either playing basketball, going to the gym, gotta spend some time with a girl. I gotta split up my time. I'm working most of the day. So time isn't always there to put how much hour, 20 some hours in to playing a one player game and the story mode, you know. I don't see the point playing a one player game in the story mode. You gotta beat one part, get the story mode here. The next few weeks, you might get some free time again to beat it. Nah, that's not me. If I'm playing a game, I'm playing a game. So, you know what I'm saying? So, one player games, you know, the last one player game I played was Devil May Cry. That new one, DMC, was really good. Really good. But I had some free time then. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But otherwise, I really just don't. I play shooters most of the time. Call of Duty, to be more specific. Might pop in a little battlefield then, but. You know, that's just how it is. And, all in all, that's it. Your boy Blue Touch him, giving a little two cents. A little two cents, you know. At least you all know I'm going to be getting the card. I'm not going to be one of those who say, oh, I'm not going to get it. Then when it drops, you know we all gonna get caught. At least everyone gets caught. Mm -hmm. You know what? Caught? <laughs> because at least you know all your boys, or most of your boys, on Xbox Live or PSN, gonna get Call of Duty. It's the universal game right now. What can we say? You know, so it doesn't know your boys do it. The longest vlog so far. <laughs> it's your boy Buddha. You want to see what I mean? One love, respect, flex.